Welcome back everybody. Today we'll be continuing from 411 cross jump. Let's go. So first thing I notice is um, A1 is quite lower than A2, so we're gonna make uh, make car A1 go quite lower than A2. A2 building a nice ramp like this. And A2 should go quite over quite easily. First problem is I built this road on the wrong place. So let me fix that quickly. After fixing that, this is what I ended up with. Um, same idea, sort of. Um, things nicely. Did get that under budget and without any breakages. So let's move on. 412 uh, steel arch bridge. Okay. The tracing tool is going to be used quite often on this one. Uh, let's just first build the road. How long is that? 36 meters. Okay. So the idea with this one will be this tracing tool using it quite a lot. Okay. Giving it an arch and flipping it. Making the first arch over there. And the second one may be somewhere over here. Uh, just symmetrical and then building a support underneath here. So let's see that, how that will go once it's done. Alright, ended up not using the supports against the roads. Very wobbly bridge. Very high stresses on it. But it seemed to work quite nicely. Um, $9,000 under budget, still wobbling, but I think I did quite nicely over there. So let's move on. Double dangle. Um, I generally don't like any bridges that have to, anything to do with these uh, hot air balloons. Okay, but anyways, so what I'm thinking of is uh, only eight roads. That might be a problem. Uh, let's just build this like that. Use the tracing tool to complete it. Get up there. Build it straight and complete the roads. Don't have enough roads. Huh. Okay. Maybe if we adjusted this thing a bit we would get up with something. Let's see what I can come up with. It turns out it does fit. Um, don't know why it didn't fit earlier. Now we need to build some uh, supports here. Maybe a double support. And then connect it with rope on certain key points, which I'm thinking will be here. And then the middle where the most stress will be. So let's see how that will go. It held it for a bit. Uh, once we support the whole bridge. Looks almost exactly the same, but just completed. Let's see how it performs. Quite a stable bridge for some reason. And finished. Um, quite easy, I would say. Did use quite a lot of a budget, but completed it. Let's move on. 414 skipper. Um, let me just check that again. Hmm. Okay, so C needs to end up there. A1 goes there. So this would be an easy straight road here. And then just a simple draw bridge over here. Supported with some hydraulics and extending so that it goes flat. Let's see how that will run. Something exactly like that. Maybe with a bit of refinement we can get there, so let's start refining. And with a bit of refining and uh, adding this over here, because um, yeah, C can't pass through A1, so it has to go over. This is what I came up with. Nice and smoothly across. 
hydraulic lifts the bridge. It then connects, sort of. Connects enough anyways. And then a final ramp to the end. Flipping over, just touching it. But that's another one done. Let's move on. 415 ups and downs. Um, I already have a headache just looking at this. And yeah, okay. So this middle part, gonna need a pivot point over here. And I think the same for every end. Um, unless we somehow just lift it up and then ramp it off there on this side. Uh, maybe that will work better, uh, lower budget. And this side the opposite. Then gonna have to be doing a whole lot of hydraulic adjustments. So let's get started on that. With a bit of refinement we might get there. So let's start refining. Okay, not gonna lie that took uh, quite a while to get under budget. I'm just under budget as well. But this is the finished product. Just gonna run through the hydraulic as well. B, these run over here to change this. D, those to run, and F, those to run again. So, left, right, left. Let's see how it runs throughout. Let's just get a nicer view of it. Goes quite smoothly. Let's speed this up a bit. Hydraulics change. Green car goes over. Next car, the taxi. Ramps, goes crazy, runs through to the end. And the last car, the police car. goes, ramps, and finishes up. So at stage 4 complete, I hope you enjoyed. Do look out for the entirety of stage 4 completed, um, should be the next video. If you enjoyed, please consider subscribing and giving this video a like. Thank you and enjoy.